All right, I'm gonna show you guys a really cool tool in Onshape, and it is a um, sheet metal tool. So the sheet metal tool we'll find in the 3D features, but before you do a sheet metal tool, you have to make a sketch. So I'm just gonna make a random sketch here. All right, so we'll just do that. I'm gonna hit the check mark. All right, now what does sheet metal tool do? Well, one thing I can do with sheet metal, which is, um, is it over here? There it is, sheet metal. So I'm gonna do sheet metal model, click on that. It'll pull up a window and it wants to know, first of all, what type we wanna do. And I'm gonna do an extrude because I made basically the path that I want the sheet metal to follow. So I'm gonna choose extrude and I'm gonna click on the sketch surfaces that I want to use. All right. And as long as my sketch follows what I wanted it to, it's going to treat this as if it's sheet metal. And so at the places where it turns or it would change its angles, um, it makes a little bit of a bend. All right. So it actually kind of does what I would want it to do. Um, the thickness depends on what sheet metal you're using. So let's say uh, it's a pretty big, thick sheet of metal. I could do like point. Um, point uh, one. All right, it's going to be pretty thick. All right, so there's my thick piece of bent sheet metal, but I can make that thickness anything I want to. All right, it totally changes um, the thickness of the, the part there. Now, let's say there are some things that I want to um, cut out of this. So let's say maybe I want uh, the end of this to have a couple of cutouts on it. I can actually do that pretty easily. Um, so I'm going to make another sketch on that surface right there. All right, and I'm going to just do a rectangle here from there to there. And I'm going to make another one from there to there, and then I'm just going to make sure that that side and that side are equal to each other in length. That'll help it to be symmetrical. All right, that's pretty cool. So check mark that. And now if I do an extrude remove on these two and I'm going to choose a through all. See if that does anything, what that does. Yeah. Hit the check mark. And notice that not only does it take out that chunk, but it also takes out the bend. All right, so it, it actually took out all of it, including the bend, which is pretty cool. And so the on shape knows that you're cutting out both those components to it. All right, so that's how you might use the sheet metal tool. Yeah. <laughs>